People were very surprised when I made the first observations of chimpanzees actually eating meat. They don't do it very often. Most of their meat is young primates, but it does make up about 2% of their diet in the year. This is called the pig hunt. Chimpanzees enjoy eating fresh meat, and they occasionally hunt young bush pigs. This is sometimes dangerous, for wild pigs, as everyone knows, can be very fierce. One day, a group of chimpanzees came across some adult pigs with young ones. The chimpanzees, bristling with excitement, began to hunt. They crashed about in the undergrowth, making a lot of commotion, so that the pigs were confused and the hunters had more opportunity to seize a piglet. But even so, each time they tried, they were charged furiously by an adult pig. Suddenly, nine-year-old Freud began to scream in terror and pain. He was young to take part in a pig hunt, and his lack of experience had landed him in trouble. He'd managed to catch a piglet, but he'd not been quick enough to climb out of danger. One of the sows, desperately trying to protect her young, had charged Freud and bitten into his rump. There was the sound of tooth on bone. The piglet escaped and ran off unharmed. Freud, screaming louder still, struggled to escape also, but the sow refused to let go. Suddenly, a large chimpanzee burst from the undergrowth, charging directly towards Freud and his captor. It was Gigi, large and childless, the Amazon of her community. The sow turned quickly to face this new challenge, and Freud, seizing his opportunity, painfully dragged himself up a tree. Gigi herself only just escaped, leaping into some low branches with her foot only a few inches from the pig's powerful jaws. Freud was badly hurt and bled heavily and it was some weeks before he could walk without limping. Gigi had, without doubt, saved his life.